Hey, what's up, y'all? Long day today, man. I'm kind of tired. Got a lot of uh, stuff that I got to pack and ship, but it's so late, I won't even get it to UPS. So let's get started on these videos, and let's jump into the 2006 All-Star Game. Kobe, the Kobe 1 Pro Tro is an update on the shoe that Kobe wore in the All-Star Game in 2006. 2000. Six. Yeah, 2006. All right. So that's 30 seconds. That's all you need. Uh, black box. It's got the swoosh at the front. Unisex sizing. Back has the swoosh. Top has the Kobe sheath and the Kobe signature. And that is that. I'll move the label up. Keep it high and see if we can stay in focus. And it's not going into great focus, so we're going to back it up. And I'm going to get into reading the label to you guys. Kobe 1 Pro Tro, white, black, varsity, red. Style code is AQ2728102. The SRP is 175. This is a size 8.5. Women's size 10. The men's 8.5 UPC is 8844997721491. Um, sometimes you can get a replacement box on these. Somebody was writing me on the uh, UNC uh, Jordan Why Not. And they were saying that their box wasn't the same color as my box. If you got it from the Nike clearance store, sometimes you can get the wrong color box. And it'll be an orange swoosh box as a replacement box. But the label should typically be the same. The UPC stuff like that is not going to change. So if your UPC is not right under the barcode on the size label, if it doesn't match your barcode, the UPC underneath it, chances are, man, you got something that's a little bit chubby. Chubby's a bad word. All right, never mind. You got something that's a little bit off, man. All right, so here we go. I'm going to show you that inside of the box first. And you see, whenever the box is painted like this, typically you won't find a stamp or a barcode. But I'm going to pull the shoes out and see if... There is a stamp or barcode on the bottom of the box. And there is not. It's pretty much empty. So let me set these down. And since we don't have our QC stamp to check and verify authenticity, I'm going to read the entire label to you guys from the inside of the Kobe Pro Tro, the Kobe One Pro Tro. But we pick it up. And it is much lighter than the original or the OG, so they stripped a lot out of it. But I'm going to take this insert out. And, oh, wow, I'm definitely going to take the insert out because on the inside of the shoe, on the insole, I'm going to have to look at both of these and get into what the names are. I guess that's like the All-Star Games, Houston, Denver, L.A., Atlanta, Philly. All-Star 2006. There's a lot of small hidden details on this shoe, man. And I love it when we get those kind of small hidden details. So I need to get into it instead of just holding it and putting it in and out of focus on you guys. But I got to get to the label. And I'm going to pull everything out of this one as well. So this video is going to go a little bit longer than even I expected. So I apologize in advance. But I always want to make sure that the insole. Here we go. You can see the locations on the inside. The insole are the same on both shoes. And they are. So let's get to this part. Oh, I want to show you the back of these and because I still haven't given you the size label yet. All-Star 2006, All-Star 2006. So let me hold that up and see if you can see it. See if I can get a good angle there. There it is, All-Star 2006 on the back of the tongue of the Kobe and then on the tongue itself move that up you've got the star where the loop is where the laces are going through so let's pull back and get this in focus now that we're back in focus I can get started on size tag I almost forgot what I was doing there man um, oh you know what I keep finding all these little details there's a swoosh on the aglets and the aglets are kind of like an aluminum but my size label, which is hard to see, dates of production are 02 21, 18 to 04 20, 
18. The small code at the top is VP. VP. And it's made in Vietnam. So it's not made in China. Made in Vietnam. Now, if there are other versions of the shoe that are made in China, then I have to get another one and let you know if that's the case. But let's jump into the 360 because we're at five minutes and that's a long time. But I want to get through it because we have a few other shoes to do. There goes your toe. There's a toe box. It's the top of the shoe. It's the left. It's the right. Left medial. I love this contrast of the dark, the black section back here. And that leather is nice. It's almost like wrinkled paper. The rest of the shoe is as well. There's the left. Move that so you can see the right. You know what this reminds me of? The uh, Michael Vicks came around around the same time. That color scheme, that Atlanta Falcons kind of color scheme, reminds me of the Michael Vicks. I don't know if it reminds you guys of the same thing, but it looks kind of similar in a way. And let's go to the back there. And we're going to wrap it up because that's six and a half minutes. That's it. Great looking shoe. Really lightweight. I like the Kobe Pro Trolls, man. Now, as far as people wearing them, fashion and style, people probably not rocking them like that. That doesn't mean it's not a dope shoe, though. It's really a nice shoe.